to Lloyd, who slashes that one high over Dave, over Billy Root. North Wales, yeah, but certainly North, the weather's impacted as Hamza bowls a fuller ball this time and Lloyd drives well past point. There'll be a race on for the fielder to get there and the ball wins. So a boundary to Lloyd and a fine way for the Derbyshire skipper to bring up his 50. Having played on was uh, Lewis Reese for Nort as Crane is in. There's a sweep shot, big appeal for Lloyd before wicket and he's gone. He went for the sweep shot and Mason Crane gets the breakthrough. Lloyd is out for 60. And it was a much needed breakthrough for Glamorgan. Over the years as he faces Douthwaite over the wicket. Again, full. This time Madsen clips it off his legs and that will run away for four. Nicely timed by Madsen to Madsen who drives nicely through the covers. And that will be four runs for Madsen. And Derbyshire, Madsen moving on to 16 at the end of the 37th over. Harrison to Wayne Madsen, drives flashing through the offside, has timed that well enough to get the boundary, I think. Uh, maybe not quite off the middle of the Madsen. Harris is moving away from us. And Bowling hit, wraps on the pads, that's close, that's out. Came's long vigil is gone. James Harris has a second wicket. He's bowled really tightly today. Two for 13. There's Crane in again. That one's a full toss, Ooh. and uh, Madsen gets hold of it Oof. and clubs it down the ground out towards the long on boundary for four. As he bowls, and Madsen sweeps, does enjoy a sweep, but he's going to get four runs out to the mid wicket boundary as it pops off the rope and into the hands of the 12th man. First boundary of the afternoon session. Continues from the Cathedral Road end to Guest, who works onto the leg side, and he's caught. Out of nothing, really, Hamza angles it in to Brooke Guest, and he flicks it. He will be able to pull that one through the mid-wicket area for four runs, though, and uh, he'll welcome that one. <laughs> runs into Donald with a leg side field, and that ball strays down the leg side. They're appealing, and it's given. And Nairin Donald caught down the leg side on his return to Glamorgan. Dan Douthwaite has his first wicket. As Crane bowls and Madsen cuts and beats the dive of point and will go through for just a single that brings up his half century. So well batted to Wayne Madsen. Brooke got a turn last week as Douthwaite is in to bowl and smashed through the offside by Madsen for four runs. Laid into that one and blasted it away. There's Douthwaite it's into bowl and that's dabbed to, down to third man by Madsen. There is no slip and it's run away for four runs. Slightly alone. I've not heard anybody's voice like that for the entire match. Bowls to Madsen who's driven it and caught. Really good catch at the second attempt by Asa Tribe. Filling it to extra cover. There's Carlson bowls to Thompson who finds the gap on the offside with a drive that may relieve a little bit of the pressure as far as Alex Thompson is concerned. That's his first boundary. From the Cathedral Road end, bowls to uh, Adalu's court. At slip, took the edge and that was a fairly straightforward slip catch in the end. As Harris bowls, that one is all driven but off an edge and it's gone down a third man. He'll get four runs for it, will Zach Chappell. There are two slips in place now and it wasn't too far away from the second of those. But Chappell is off the mark with the boundary. Crane to Thompson. Oh, that's over. Flighted no. and caught at mid on. It was a full toss. It was a filthy delivery. And Thompson somehow managed to sky it straight into the hands of Dan Douthwaite. Crane is in, again, full delivery, and he's bowled him this time. Beautifully delivered by Crane. That accounts for Connors, who departs three wickets to show for it as he's in again to Chapel. That one's back of a length, and Chapel cashes in with that one. In Six. fact, it goes all the way. As a punchy shot on the back foot from Chapel. Crane is in again, and Chapel just <laughs> sweeps that nicely. That will run away down to the boundary for four, so... Over the wicket and balls down the leg side. It's uh, turned nicely off a hip and off a bat by Blair Tickner for his first run. As Kane pushes for... Oh, Tickner pushes forward and he's bowled. And Crane has a fourth. 
Derbyshire are dismissed for 198 as uh, Chapel is into Ul Hassan. A wide one that he carves through the offside for four runs to the point boundary. The empty grandstand away to our right. As Root drives through the offside and smashes that one away for four. Stephen and Jim scored. Thompson is in bowls and that one is striking on the pad and he's been given this time and Ul Hassan has gone. He doesn't like it. Thompson has the breakthrough. And in comes Thompson and bowls. North East is beaten. Has he been caught? He's been he's been bowled. He's been bowled. Has he first ball or was it a catch? Carlson on strike then. Thompson to bowl. Carlson sweeps. The shouts from the Derbyshire fielders, but he's Boding as Kame comes around the wicket to the left-handed Ingram who drives expansively through the covers and that's a well-timed shot, a boundary for Ingram. Fifth over. Tossed up and Ingram drives but it's expertly fielded by an Aaron Donald diving to his right. That ends the over to Morgan, 74 for four.